Hey there, everyone. Hope you are doing great. Uh, we haven't been up to much, really. We have been, as you can see, uh, saving some energy because uh, the next fusion should be starting uh, in a couple days. And yeah, it looked like it would be good. Uh, it's going to be night revs. And yeah, I think I'm pretty strong in there, but I do not have someone to revive. So yeah, I think that would uh, help a lot. Plus, I think the A2 is a uh, shield and uh, cleanse. So it's kind of like Mithrala, which is a very nice move. So yeah, I will be going for that. The only concern I have is last week was 2x sacreds, was it not? They keep changing it and moving it now, so it's kind of hard to follow. But I was expecting there to be 2x Ancients for the uh, Summon Rush for this. But I'm not sure that's going to happen because usually the Summon Rush is first and Champ Chase is second, which means that the Summon Rush should be in a couple days, which wouldn't be... In line with what normally happens right every other week being a 2x event so we'll have to see what comes of that uh yeah i think we picked up a few more a few more sacred shards yeah we're sitting at 13 which is really good and almost 100 ancient shards so we know it's been a while since i had the 2x on that because usually i pull all i have when that comes around and i'm sure i will again so yeah, if that's the case, so that would be great because summon rush, we can get a lot of points with our ancients that we would pull anyway. And champ chase, yeah, we still didn't even pull out a lot of these uh, fragments. No gray, Timmit, Yannicka, we still have all those. We have Akoth ready. Check it out. Maybe another week, two for sure. We'll be getting Mithrala. And uh, yeah, we're coming up on Yarkarl and Cleopetrix too from the, the logins. So yeah, we've got all kinds of stuff to pull. I am not going to mess with uh, turning in shards when it comes out unless they change maybe the amount of shards or the chance. From what I've seen, it doesn't look like there is a, a great chance to get amount of fragments you need to uh, get that new legendary. So for newer accounts, if you could pick up uh, what five star chickens and legendary books and stuff should help. And yeah, as an ogre, I was thinking about her kit could enable an unkillable clan boss team, I suppose, with Emic. However, I think it would still be uh, a problem with affinity because you're not going to be affinity friendly, I don't think. So yeah, I kind of just keep waiting for that one last piece to be able to get an unkillable team. But uh, yeah, it's not coming around. <laughs> this lunar event, I'm thinking a lot of people skipped it. As you can see, I have 20 points. So, yeah, that's real, real great. <laughs> so, I, I've been pretty much just as usual. Uh, before I started saving energy, I was uh, doing uh, masteries again. And also, for the monthlies, if I'm not doing anything special and I'm trying to save energy, I'll just run campaign on normal and kind of get these out of the way. So, when the end comes around I don't have to worry about it because yeah normally I don't really ever run campaign so there is that and uh, not too much happening there's a tag tournament going on which I just kind of always farm it so we're doing fairly well in that so we get a few resources and it sounds like they're going to change the souls which should be good I'm hoping to pick up another one here but yeah, it's just too hard to get souls. 200 more points, we should get that. So, and it seems, yeah, they are just making uh, having souls that much more important, right? So, if you can awaken them, it's going to be a, a big help. Oh, I didn't even know I had a awakening for Elva. Hmm, that's great. We'll have to put that, put that on her. And uh, maybe that helps at some point to... Uh, get through those Centronos ones where you have to have so many awakenings. So, yeah, like I say, just been uh, kind of sitting back, collecting our resources, and we'll we'll spend them here on the fusion. And, uh, yeah, that should help propel us forward. As 
far as champs, I'm not sure who we're looking for to 60 next. Hmm. Maybe Rosin. Like I said before, if we do get an unkillable team, usually those unkillable teams just have space for one champ to kind of be DPS. And he can do fair DPS and also with his... I have to have books. So. <laughs> with this skill, he can put decreased defense and weaken up, which would be great. So I think maybe he is in the uh, four running for that. I'm not even sure. Let's check our books. Only 12... I'm gonna have a lot of epic books now. Could uh, book someone, I suppose. I think most of the people that need it are. Good old Skaramis. I think I'll probably book him. I have plenty to, to do, right? So he can come in. He helps in Faction Wars. He's gonna help probably in one of the Hydra teams, which I think we, we already kind of did today. So, yeah, we put in two weak keys here. So we'll get novice chest, and I think I'm going to get the adept chest here. What did we get? For hard, we got eight. So, yeah, we'll pick up adept chest. I really hate how they have the same chest for for this, right? What's, what's the point? That's just kind of stupid. So, but like I said last time, I'm just trying to get as many chests as I can to... Uh, Finish off the Mithrala, then I can focus on getting a top chest and something to, to get uh, better gear or whatnot. And yeah, we're stuck in Cursed City. Gonna reset soon anyway. Doom Tower. Yeah, we're still stuck on that hard. I really haven't tried to go through that again. And yeah, we're just right now pushing up to get to the top of normal, which looks like we've beaten already before, so it shouldn't be a big thing. And pick up another Void Shard from that. So, that's good. And I think that's about about it, yeah. Nothing else is uh, happening that's too exciting. Not big on these uh, progressives. I mean, I think it's good. Could be good for epics, right? So, if you need a Shamel, and you have a fair amount of shards, the epics... I think you can you can pick up the one you want, but as far as legendaries, it's so rare anyway. We do have a primal to pull, which will be good for points too. So yeah, so I'll be coming back soon, probably with with some videos on the uh, next fusion. Say just concerned about uh, what's going to be for the summon rush. Hopefully, it's two X ancients like it's supposed to be. Otherwise, if it pushes back another week, it's going to be two X ancients. For Champ Chase, which I guess isn't real bad, but I think I would rather have it, for me anyway, for the Summon Rush, because I have plenty of uh, Champs for Champ Chase in here, or that I can fuse. So, yeah, we'll see what happens with it. So, alright, let me know if you're going for the fusion in the uh, comments below. Seems like she's pretty good, and uh, yeah, that'll do it. See you next time. Take care.